Like right now where y'all are at, this is the easy part of life. Like this is the easiest it's going to get. Every step, especially you seniors, every step after this, the next level is harder. It don't get easier. Like a lot of you aspire to be, you know, college football players or whatever it is you want to do. You aspire to go to the next level. Well, once you get there, you haven't just arrived. Once you get there, the work has just begun. And the further you want to go, the bigger your dreams are, the harder it's going to get at each level. All right, so today is just all about you guys. We came out here, pour out into you, give us the knowledge that we have so that y'all can come out and live the dreams that we live. I'm from Piscataway, grew up on 3rd Street, went to school at Ohio State University, won a Super Bowl with the Saints in 2009, and now I'm with the Philadelphia Eagles. All we ask is that y'all give us everything you got and we'll give you everything we got, all right? Oh, come on, come on, get out, get out, get out, get out. Too young to be tired. I want them to realize that I was once in their shoes, and so was you know the rest of my colleagues. We were all sitting in the same place that they are. We didn't just arrive in the NFL. We had to work hard and come up from the bottom just like they did. We had to overcome challenges, overcome obstacles, and that they could really accomplish the same things we could. It just takes that focus, that hard work, and that dedication. So whereas most camps, some people do 40 times, and it's usually like hand time, unofficial. We got the laser times out here. It's all real. These kids are getting their real valuations. Just like they training for the NFL Combine, we doing it all out here, man. Next level football camp, let's go. I mean, I never had these kind of opportunities. You know, there were no camps when I grew up. So this is a unique opportunity for them. And I think they, they really enjoy it. A lot of the kids have the effort, they have the heart. They just don't have the know-how. So you give them one tip and they try it and they perform better than they did last time. And really, that's all you want is to be able to give them a little bit of knowledge, you know, and then help them see that they can be the athlete that they aspire to be as well. The thing about press is everybody wants to jam and they leave their hands there, but their feet not moving. And all the receiver is going to do is smack your hands and you're going to be stuck. So it's always feet before hands. So as soon as the ball snaps, you got to have your feet ready to move wherever way you want to go, whatever way you want to go. I'm going to step with him and use my hands after that. I think it's important to give back to the communities that brought me up. So Piscataway is the first place that really kind of raised me. It's really an opportunity to give back to the whole community. And I also want to give back to those areas in which I like went to school. I do some stuff in Columbus, Ohio, New Orleans, now Philly. So everywhere that I get to get a chance to live or get a chance to have an impact, I want to really spread my wings and then um, affect those areas. That's a good job uh, with the first part of camp and your training and your testing. What do we need to break it down on? Squat on three. Squat? Squat, Squat on three. One, two, three. Squat! Squat!